Mr. Josephat Oklu is the CEO of Jozak Metal and Construction Company. He is a Ghanaian entrepreneur is also into block molding business, and he has found a way of fabricating his own block molding machines. These machines include 1. A cement mixer 2. Block molding machine 3. Wheelbarrows 3. We asked him when he started this business, and he said Oh, I've been in this uh, job for the past 30 years According to him, he has been producing the block molding machine for about 20 years. Uh, the block machine, you can see that we, 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 we've done this ourselves, that the block molding machine, you can see it. Um, this one, I've done it myself to fabricate the various sizes of the blocks. Uh, because there may be the possibility of uh, light going off, we've attached this engine to it, so that when the light is off, you can quickly fall on this to, to work in the sun. Yeah, so it has a multi-purpose. When there is light, we use it. When there is no light, we also use it. Asked what advantage his block molder has over imported ones, he said. Well, uh, it's a locally manufactured block machine. So we have our own size of block that we, we, we use here, uh, which is 18 inches by 9 inches by 5 inches or 4 or 6. If you see the machines that they normally import from abroad, we don't have the actual size of the block. So in that case, you use more blocks. This one, you use the actual height and the actual number that you need to get to the length of level. So this is the advantage this one has over the imported one. Asked what motivated him to invent the cement mixing machine, he said. And the cement mixing machine is also invented as a result of looking at how the boys work. Uh, one of the secrets of this block business is that you have to mix the, the sand, the cement and everything well to become uniform. In the morning they will start well, but the afternoon going, the mixing will not be well. So we saw the need of bringing in this mixer which works continuously throughout the whole day and you have the perfect mixing of the product so that when you produce the block, you have it perfectly and strong. We, we, we are always promoting or encouraging uh, locally manufactured machines. And when you like, manufacture it here, any machine has its problems. And when there is a problem, since you manufacture it here, you can easily fix it by imported ones, either you fabricate or you import some parts. So these are the, some of the advantages. And this one too, since you manufacture it here, you can have your actual size that you want. If you want it smaller, you can have it. If you want it bigger, you can have it. But since we start using the machine, we've seen that the product is very, very strong and they are always praising the blocks. Actually, in this whole community, uh, we can confidently say we are, we are on top of the list when it comes to strength of our block products. The Ghanaian industrialist also produces wheelbarrows. So as you can see, this is one of the locally manufactured wheelbarrows that we have done ourselves here. And we've been using this wheelbarrow for the past five years. And you can see that it's still strong. Uh, when you compare it to the imported ones, you cannot even use them for three months. Uh, so. We, we, we are endeavouring to do everything here locally so that we can use our own products. These are some of the locally manufactured wheelbarrows, as you can see. All these are, you can start from this one. 
you can see this one that we've started has not yet been sprayed. Yeah, this has not yet been sprayed. It's been manufactured here. Right. Now, look at the other one too that have been sprayed. This one is ready. We are yet to fit the ties. And uh, you can see the other one too. Let me use this for you. Uh -huh. This one is ready to be used. And you can see it to be very strong. And you can use it for a long time.